Welcome back, Rico Moneybags, the channel helping you invest in yourself so we can invest in the future. Welcome back, my Myro community. We're going to go ahead and get this video started right away at the end. We'll talk about price predictions and technical analysis, but we're going to jump right into this video because I feel like people have forgot. I got to ask you, did you forget who Myro was? Do, do you remember the good boy? I just because I'm going to take people back to what happened last time when people faded the good boy. And I know the rest of the markets are pulling back and BTC is pulling back and everything has, you know, a correction happening. But this video is important. So let's get this video to 100 likes like that. We can help out with panic sellers because let's face it, we want more new retail investors to come in, brand new investors, normies. But they don't know what's going on. So how about we spread the word, show them how to load up on supports and understand that these corrections are normal. But we got this by El Squacho. I mean, bro, love this. A road with potholes is a small burden to bear on the path to Valhalla de Medici. I mean, you know, we're still here. We already talked about this. And I mean, I really hope that some of you have learned your lesson. We're going to go over the latest and greatest. We're going to get some tweets out. I mean, we got some clean charts by the community. Big shout out to Roddy. Rodney. Rodney honestly never faded the good boy through thick and thin rodney's been here so big shout out to rodney make sure you guys engage with this uh same goes right here let's keep going down i mean you know the the same captains and veterans and ogs are still here we know but let's face it we want new investors to come in we know that we're having an influx of new investors so there's going to be some growing pains there's going to be some teething pains that's exactly why crypto is extra volatile because there's less experienced people i'd rather not call them jeets i'd rather not you know call them out their name and this that and the other it's just that they're lacking a little bit of knowledge so if you are buying high and selling low this video is for you if when you buy the price goes down if when you sell the price goes up this video is for you, okay? It's okay. It's happened to everyone. I don't care who they are. And if they say anything different, that's a lie. That's like a, when, when you ride motorcycles. There's two different types of riders. The ones that, that have been down and the ones that are going down. So you get to experience this no matter what. But that's why it's important to share these videos. So like that, we can help people, you know, go through these pains a lot faster. But I love this real quick uh, because this is what's going on. We've seen the rest of the markets pulling back. But Solana has been holding super strong. But it's the power of the meme coins. Literally, this was Solana from 10 to 100 and then we got solana to 100 to 200 now but it's the meme coins bringing in all this hype to solana and it's gonna keep coming in but people jumping into our projects that we've been holding to you know they don't understand these market fluctuations so you guys know that i'm bullish on all these projects you guys if you guys are part of the money bags mansion you guys should still be up right now we are still in the green we are still in the positive even when we dca'd a myro from that last dip we're still so there's nothing to worry about if you're in the money bags mansion it is free link down below in the description you guys know the rest so let's go ahead and continue scroll down a little bit big shout out to dr defi i mean we we talked about it dr defi you know we got to pull up even in the red and you know what call it deja vu call it what it has to be but we'll do it again we'll pull up once again you know keith will pull up once again el squacho will pull up once again uh easy sabo will hold it down for us with his i mean beautiful technical analysis i'm gonna keep dropping videos we already had a taste of this so you know i'm just scrolling through this making sure you know people recognize what's going on with our good boy but we're gonna get to the prices because let's face it when the prices pump um we're happy but when they pull back i mean it's like a tragedy happening right there there goes the comments there goes all the messages all the dms yada 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 if you dca from the last time that we you know got into this beautiful good boy that's been so good to us make sure you return the favor to this good boy let's go ahead and do this i know my chart looks a lot crazier than a lot of other people but i like to pay attention to support and resistance because i think it helps show people to stop loading up on resistance because that creates panic sellers especially if you even DCA'd anywhere in here when we did it in the money bags mansion down here and people were blowing me up like, are you still bullish on Myro? We got in over here. We saw the pump, right? It's our history. We're going to talk about it because people who are new, I want them to, to remember that we've been here before. Don't get caught up in this spot. And then this happens and some kind of Binance special thing happens. And then now you're chasing the tops again. Hey, if that's your game more power to you. Like I said before, many times, this is not financial advice. So if your game is buy high, sell low, Go ahead, do what you do. But at the end of the day, those who DCA with me in the money bags mentioned all through this period right here, we are still up. We're we're still above the last all time high. So even and I'll be honest with you guys, even the support right here, this is uh that technically is a healthy correction. I know we don't technically want to see pullbacks like this, and we want to see Bitcoin go to the moon and everything pump nonstop. Of course, we all want that. But this being a prior resistance on the daily chart, if we zoom 
out, my people. If we zoom out on the daily chart, this is a resistance and this is a support. That is probably one of the healthiest corrections you can see right there. And I can see Myro definitely pumping right back up to that 270 and, and really getting back above that $250 million market cap. That's going to be, you know, that psychological barrier right there. So we got, you know, 250, 255, 260. But really that gap between 250 to 300 is going to be that next zone. And then where we tapped out last time was that 450. So, you know, we'll get back over 250, no problem. And then we'll chase going back to three and we'll keep going nonstop. This, this is my role. I, I want to, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, make sure the bell notification is lit, but we've been here before. And trust me, it was a little bit more chaotic because there was no explanation or there, you know, there was just FUD and stuff. This is not FUD. This is just market correction. This is not miscommunication. This is not people fudding bags. This is a little bit of, you know, people not being educated. Maybe, you know, a little bit of panic selling because, you know, we could hold prices a little bit tighter. So I'm going to call you guys. If you guys are, you know, really holding it down for Myro for this good boy, hold the line because I'm here to reassure you that the good boy is still going to be good. We're still going to show up. We're still pulling up. This is another sign, another sign right here, this support right here. So we've been here before another support happening. We've been here before. Let's not act brand new. We've been here before. If you're new to the channel, you, you can act brand new. It's all good. It's all good. You can do what you do, but we're about to pump right back up. So I want you to see this as a buying opportunity. We have to change the way that we're looking at things. If you're not happy with your current situation right now, maybe it's time that you give it a go and you switch the way you're, you look, you look at things, right? Your perspective, like change your philosophy behind things. I'm not trying to tell you to, to learn technical analysis overnight, to learn chart patterns. That's a little bit difficult. But if you can learn the philosophy and, and kind of your emotions, I, I think you'll be pretty good because if you can change your perspective and not panic when it's red and you turn into to a buyer, not financial advice, but you turn into a person that wants to load up. Let's say that on when it's red. Let me know if that changes your life for the better, because that's that's how the game is played. When the markets are fearful, you need to be greedy. When the markets are greedy in this zone, you need to be fearful. That's how it plays. You don't need to be that fearful, but that's the play. That's how you go about it when you're looking for positions. If you're looking for another position, if you're looking for an entry, you know, you should be drooling. Your fangs should be sticking out. You should be looking like the, the bad wolf and Little Red Riding Hood right now, ready to, you know, sink your, your teeth in because this is a fire sale right now. This is a fire sale. This is a discount right now. You should be trying to lure, you know, people to get these positions. And I see people loading up right now. I see the buys coming in. The markets are going to correct. We're not going nowhere. The good boy's not going nowhere. We're going to keep building. We're going to keep showing up. I'm here to let everybody know the good boy's going to continue to deliver. You guys help me get the word out there. Let's hold the line. Those who know what's up, hold the line. Let's go. Let's spread the word. We're still here. This is a normal market correction. Do not get caught up. <laughs> Do not get caught up like this back here. And I'm not trying to make fun of anybody. It, it happens in the space, right? People don't know. But I was telling everybody that we were okay. And we were. And we pulled back to some scare. We're not. That's not going to happen in this case. Bitcoin's not going to pull back that much. The market's just doing a simple correction. On the daily chart, this is healthy. Even on the two-hour chart, this is a healthy correction. We're still above where we are just happy to be. So this is just a normal pullback. We just, you know, we get so comfortable so fast that any little drip, then we're, we're panicking right away. Well, I'm not. I'm, I'm looking at this like, oop, find opportunity. <laughs> That's for sure. Start a different bag. I don't want a dollar cost my average bag up. I'll leave that bag alone and start a new bag. And that will be another DCA bag. That's how I play. I'm, I'm not playing around with this one. This is the good boy, Myro. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and share the video, and continue to come back and experience the abundance of money with me because you deserve it. Until next time, you guys know what it is.